In today's video, we are going to backtest one simple trading view indicators strategy 100 times, which also claims to be the most powerful. This strategy combines one of our favorite indicators with an interesting approach to a stop loss placement, which we prefer as well. More precisely, we will backtest the strategy known as the most powerful and simple trading view strategy created by Max Trade Academy, and let's assess the effectiveness of this strategy by evaluating its key operating metrics, including the real win ratio, profit factor, and account growth. Moreover, the author claims that this strategy works in any market, including Forex, crypto, and stocks. During this video, we also will show you how you can get access to our top-notch private indicator, known as Quant Algo. This algo tells you when to buy and when to sell, giving you an insane advantage over other traders. Before we move on, if you want to show us your support and speed up the release of a lot of new content, make sure to hit the subscribe button and hit the notifications bell. It's only two clicks but it means a lot to us. Without further ado, let's start discussing the trading rules for this exact strategy. First, open the indicator's window, type Haken Ashi Smoothed Candles, and add the following indicator created by our plus to the chart. We should remain settings by default. The trading rules are fairly simple. When the smoothed Haken Ashi candle becomes green, we receive a signal for the trade long. Consequently, when the smoothed Haken Ashi candle becomes red, we can jump into the trade short. As you can see, this is a perfect solution when we have a trending market. So, moving on to the next indicator. Once again, go to the indicators tab, type 8 TR bands and choose this indicator created by the tier D floor. Again, we're not going to change any settings in this case. The ATR bands are reflecting the current volatility in the market. Hence, it is a very powerful tool for setting your stop loss, allowing you to protect the trade against volatility spikes. Let's dive deeper into it by considering an example. So, after entering the long trade based on the green smooth taken ashy candle, we should place the stop loss right on the lower red band. Exactly the opposite is true for the bearish case. We need to place the stop loss on the upper green band right here. At this point, let's summarize the risk management rules once again. We place the stop loss on the upper green ATR band in a bearish case, and on the lower red ATR band in a bullish case. When it comes to take profit, we should target a 1.5 for 1 risk to reward ratio. Putting it all together, let's consider a live example of the brilliant long trade. Here's Dollarcad, a 15 minute time frame. As you can see, the smoothed Haken Ashi candle turns green right here, which serves as a trigger event for the trade entry long. So, we enter the trade on this candle, placing our stop loss right at the red ATR band, and targeting a 1.5 risk to reward ratio. And boom, our take profit was hit. Moving on to the short example. Here's gold, a 30 minute time frame. As can be seen, the red smoothed Haken Ashi candle appears right here, so that let's enter the trade short on the given candle. We should place the stop loss on the upper green 8TR band right here, and target 1.5 risk to reward ratios. Again, the price tanked down and hit our target. It is also important to note that the author has shown an example of this strategy on the euro dollar, a one hour time frame, so that to be highly conservative, let's use the same currency pair but change the time frame to 15 minute, in order to find those 100 trades a bit faster. With this in mind, let's finally backtest this strategy 100 times and analyze the outcomes. For backtesting purposes, we will utilize software from TraderEdge since it is one of the most efficient backtesting tools available on the market at the moment. Thousands of traders are using TraderEdge to get an edge on their competition. This intuitive and easy to use backtester gets up to three times faster results than using classic spreadsheets. Also, P&L Calendar and Trade Journal enables you to track your trades and identify what's working and what's not. Finally, the Indicators and Strats tab shows you the most profitable indicators and strategies that can be implemented in your trading. In addition, you will receive a full step-by-step -step backtesting guide, a full course on how to build a profitable mechanical trading strategy, and four pre-made high-quality strategies, 
worthing over $470 for free. Trader Edge has a 7-day free trial so there's absolutely no risk. Click the link in the description below. So, let's set our initial equity size at 1000. Meanwhile, our profit equals 3% and loss equals 2%, which translates into a 1.5 risk to reward ratio. So, we just accomplished the backtesting process. As expected, the results were not so good because the smoothed Haken Ashi indicator is a trigger event indicator that definitely should be combined with some confirmation oscillators for maximum performance. With this in mind, we have already created such a strategy and backtested it on our channel, so feel free to catch it up. At this point, let's move on to the results. Finally, we want to share with you our top private indicator, Quant Algo, which can be used in combination with previously discussed indicators or on its own. This high quality algorithm, which combines complex trading processes to tell you when to buy and when to sell, was developed to enhance your trading experience. You can use it on any time frame for different asset classes. So, if you want to access Quant Algo to get results fast, all links will be in the description and the comment section below. Without this algo will put you at a disadvantage. Unsurprisingly, after 100 trades, the win rate came in at just 44%. As we've already said, the main problem with this strategy is that the author uses only one trigger event indicator. As a result, our account would grow by only 18.44%, which is quite a low figure, especially adjusting it by trading fees and spreads. Let's assume that you start trading with $1,000 of initial equity. In this case, your account size would rise to about $1,240 after 100 trades. In terms of the profit factor, it equals 1.18, which is considered to be a very low value. And let's also interpret our additional stats. As you can see, we had 5 consecutive wins against 5 consecutive losses, which sends us warning signs. The five losses in a row, especially if you use high leverage, can hurt your account significantly. Next, our largest profit per trade was 3%, while the largest loss per trade stood at 2% due to the 1.5 risk to reward ratio. Finally, the equity curve looks terrible. As you can see, we have multiple periods with considerable drawdown. Moreover, our max drawdown stood at 15.43% with 1% risk per trade, meaning that even 10x leverage will blow your account. As for now, let's add this strategy to our spreadsheet with backtesting results, and, as can be seen, in terms of win rate and account growth, this strategy currently holds the last position. With that being said, we don't recommend using this strategy in its current form. If you like this new format and want to see more backtesting videos, let us know in the comments below. We always appreciate your feedback. Thanks for your time and I'll see you in the next video.